it's good to see you. It's good to see you. I we, didn't get here as fast as you wanted me to, but I am here now. Well, here's the thing. <laughs> we are supposed to start the show at a certain time, but every single day we start the show usually about an hour early. Well, let's, here's the thing. When you get a schedule, for hair and makeup, and you live about 40 minutes away? When That's you your get problem. <laughs> you mean I should just relocate to Burbank? You should be closer. Yes, like Toluca Lake. I that should just be... live in Toluca Lake. I would so like when you that. call, uh -huh. I will jump. Yeah. Um, <laughs> no, I thought you're just, you know. Just I... hanging out, just waiting to get to the Owen show. Right, that's what I thought. No, you... I'm, so, I'm nervous. I'm thinking about things. I'm, you know, getting all gussied up Listen, for you guys. Don't even. <laughs> This is, don't, she's, I don't know what she does with her money, but this is what she looks like without anything on. This is like, you just naturally are beautiful. You know, oh. you're, you're just, burn your money. I just burn just my burn money. Just burn your money to give it to somebody yeah. to do, they're taking the pretty away. I heard that I just away. made a million dollar uh, body re makeover. Did you, you read that? No, you got a million dollar body. Apparently I spent, I had a million dollar makeover. Wow. So there you go. Uh, well, <laughs> it cost a million dollars. Yeah. yeah, that's amazing. So the that's whole the body was done. Oh, I, I, you just sort of lift it all and then tie it and snip it. <laughs> Throw it out. You lift it and tie it and snip it. I don't know. Wow. Yeah, it is un unbelievable. We talk about this all the time. I but know. They just make up whatever they want to make up. It's quite entertaining, though, isn't yeah. it? I throw those away whenever I go into any kind of doctor's office or... Where you got your makeover? Where I got my makeover. Yeah. <laughs> or, uh, yeah, a lot, anywhere. And if I find, you know... No, I don't throw that You're not away. gonna throw this away. <laughs> I just I just saw this the yeah. other day. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I mean... Come on. You, you know are, how you just lounge on a chair in the ocean? <laughs> you just sort of do that. Where was this? Where'd you take this picture? I was in the ocean. Yeah? In the Pacific Ocean. And it was just floating? Just floating. And I just was like, I'm going to swim out to that and have some deep thoughts. Uh-huh. And that's what happened. Oh, well, you look fantastic. Thank you. <laughs> now, you, you, would, you enjoy being naked. You take care of I love it. You do. <laughs> <laughs> That was intense. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Um, well, you take very good care of yourself, and you you enjoy doing activities, and I so love activities, you're yeah. not like ashamed of of like when you're holding your breasts like that yeah. and and getting a picture taken. I'm not ashamed of that. No. No. Uh. Uh. Well, no one should be. No. <laughs> Do it now. Do it right now. Do it now. <laughs> Only if you did it with me. Oh, oh see. No, I don't even do that by myself. Yes, you do. <laughs> I know you, you uh, sit there and you're just like, mm -hmm. uh, oh. I do. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> just waiting for Portia to come home with the. It, yes. Just at, the, at the garage. Yes. <laughs> Shifting. Wait, this position yeah. isn't good. Um, can we talk about. So you, yes. you went to Mexico uh, a while back and uh, had a very bad experience. And I know you're not a good flyer. Yeah. Oh, yes, you're, yes. Yeah. This I'm my not, birthday, right? Yeah, I'm not, it was your birthday extravaganza. Yeah, I was you surprised. Going, yeah, they were taking you to Mexico. Yeah, um, I didn't know where I was going, to be honest. Right. So, until... and it was supposed to be so, so low key. So low key. <laughs> I, I hear from someone, Jen's plane, you know, is in trouble. They had an emergency landing. So I texted you right away. Well, you were actually, with the. What happened was when we were in flight, I was, it was very turbulent. Everyone else is calm as a cucumber because they're not afraid of flying. And it's really bumpy and it's sort of on a tilt. So it's about an hour and a half of white knuckling it. And then the stewardess so it says to me, can you, the pilot would like to talk to you? And I said, I don't want to talk to the pilot. <laughs> I sent one of my very calm friends to go talk to the pilot. And then came back to find out that we have actually turned around and we're going back to California because we think we've lost a wheel. <laughs> and yeah. I was like, oh, well, we've got seven more, right? <laughs> and then everybody on the plane started panicking and text, like, my, everyone who I look for for com comfort and, and, like, we're okay, right, is got tears streaming down their faces, are texting their children, their partners, their loved ones. And I was like, oh, who do I? 
text, thing, and then because you can get texts up in the air, you're the first person that was like, are you okay? Yeah. And I was like, Ellen, I do have someone who loves me. <laughs> I'm yeah. kidding, but um, <laughs> I mean, I'm not, I love you, I was, but it was, you were very concerned. <laughs> but I w couldn't believe how calm I became and everyone else was, and then everybody's phone, it's like, bleh. so so there goes the like under the radar kind of like secret trip to Mexico. Um, and then, yeah, we landed and I sent you that picture yeah. of like ambulances, fire trucks, um, cause we had, and we had to fly around for like six hours. To dump the fuel. To dump the fuel, which still wasn't occurring to me. This might be because if we land badly, it will explode. And so I, I'm, I just, yeah, it just shows you how irrational fear of flying is. Yeah. When there's things that you really shouldn't be afraid of, and then when there's actually something you should be afraid of, you're not. Yeah, you weren't. No. But then, um, but then everybody kind of, then you had to get, so that flight took you, because you had to go all the way back. Yeah. Then you had to fly to Mexico again. Well, we had to, we just, that was the plan. Yes. So we just decided to follow through with it. <laughs> right. Yeah. So there was yeah. drinking going on to. Well, in order to get back on the other plane, well, everyone's, everyone's like, how could you get back on another plane? And I was like, listen, we had to fly around for six hours dumping fuel. We all got pretty hammered. Because <laughs> who knew what, what the end of this was going to be? Yeah. Well, let's go out with a, you know, well, some tequila. Exactly. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. All right, we're going to take a break. And um, I'm glad that you're OK. Thank and, you. and I'm sorry that I called you to, to get you here early. That's OK. But you look beautiful. Thank you. And I'm happy you're here. And I love you. I'm happy I'm here. All right. Always. We'll be back. <laughs>